When we think of laziness, we usually see it as a flaw. But through the lens of evolution, what we call laziness can often be a survival advantage. In nature, every action has an energy cost, and wasting energy without reason could mean death. Lions, for example, spend more than 18 hours a day resting, and crocodiles can stay motionless for hours in the sun. This is not weakness, it's efficiency. By conserving energy, they save their strength for critical moments like hunting or escaping danger. Evolution often favors such energy-saving strategies. This idea is supported by optimal foraging theory, which shows that animals evolve to gain the most food with the least effort. A predator that chases everything it sees will starve. A predator that moves only when the reward is worth the cost has better chances of survival. Even in humans, our ancestors did not live in a world of constant food supply. Resting between hunts or foraging trips conserved precious calories. The drive to rest when possible is deeply wired in our brains. Dopamine, the same chemical that rewards us for food and pleasure, also shapes how much effort we are willing to spend. If the reward doesn't seem worth the cost, our brain nudges us toward inactivity. In the modern world, with supermarkets full of food and technology reducing physical work, this ancient adaptation turns into a health risk. The same instinct that once kept us alive now pushes us toward sedentary lifestyles. But there's another side too. Laziness can fuel creativity. Many inventions and technologies came from people looking for easier, less effortful solutions. In that sense, laziness has driven innovation. So rather than seeing it as a flaw, we can understand laziness as an evolutionary tool, one that helped our ancestors survive, but now challenges us to balance comfort with health.